Unfortunately, the last 500 years of history has been an, a, a history of imperialism. We wake up today in the 21st century and look out upon a world which has the, gives the impression of having always been like this. But it has not always been like this. Uh, the fact of the matter is that Africa is the richest continent on earth in terms of natural resources. 12 million square miles when you count the islands of natural resources of tremendous wealth. A place where billions of dollars every year are taken from Sierra Leone, Sierra Leone as an example in the form of diamonds on the one hand. But on the other hand, where the African workers who bring those diamonds to the surface, for Europe, for North America especially, are expected to live of 30 cents a day, and if they are lucky, a cup of rice. Africa is not poor. Africa is being looted. Not only looted of natural resources, but human resources as well. And this is something that has been going on for a very long time. So I'm hoping that this Congress will be able to look at the question of Africa, its relationship to the North, if you will, not through pitying eyes, but through eyes of outrage. I'm hoping that this Congress, at minimum, will bring people to a different consciousness about the relationship that Africa has to the world and perhaps allow us to come to some different conclusions about what it is that we can do uh, to change uh, this relationship.